Hello folks, welcome back to Cartoony Gameplay, and it is now time to do something that we've been promising for a while. Yes. Because Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated comes out in less than two weeks, and because it's going to be on Steam, there will be no purpose for a lot of people to play this. This right here is the original PC version of Battle for Bikini Bottom. This is not developed by Heavy Iron Studios. This is a completely different game published, I mean, developed, sorry, by Op Productions. You might know them better for doing employ Operation Krabby Patty and dang it, Employee of the Month. Wow. It's, this is how we usually are. What do you expect, Bart? Oh, okay. Um, I want to clarify now. I think I've already said this, but they also developed uh, the PC version for the movie game. Lights, camera, pants, and they also did a Nighty Nightmare, which is the PC version of Creature from the Krusty Krab. But uh, these we're not going to cover anytime soon. These are probably for some time in the distant future. Oh, great. Yeah, so that doesn't really matter. But anyway, no more beating around the bush. Let us do this before this little title right here becomes pointless in the world. All right, let's do it. Now, this is also uh, another SpongeBob game for PC that does not run properly on uh, modern hardware. However, so, however, uh, oh. okay. Whatever. Oh, don't, don't say that. Um, however, um, it can be fixed with DG Voodoo, as usual. But you might notice, uh, we are using uh, DG Voodoo. However, you might notice that the watermark is no longer on the bottom right. Yeah, it turns out we didn't even set the thing up properly. So, um, we managed to fix that. So now, you won't have that stinking watermark in the bottom right. Yes. So, thank goodness. Uh, you can look up on how to do that. And here they are again. Op Productions. Oh, boy. Are you oh, ready? no, no, no. Okay. When, that ha when we had that with uh, Employee of the Month, we had to cut that out because it's copyright. Uh, it's time to begin the battle for Bikini Bottom. But the, you mentioned the title. Oh, don't mention the title, Plankton. Now to activate my uh, army of blindly loyal robot minions. Oh, jeez. One of them looks like Tartar, but without an antenna and without the Tartar sauce. Uh, uh, Today we. I mean, today I will conquer Bikini Bottom and you, you say that like every single day of your life. <laughs> uh, what's with that robot's head? Oh! You <laughs> it just swore! It just swore! Plankton, watch your My mouth! Uh, uh, we're going to get the new one to talk. Oh. Get lost. It's weak. What's this? See the obey plankton switch on my robot generator was set to off. Okay, let me say this. It's not as funny when he points that out. It's like the battle for Bikini Bottom. It was priceless because it just zoomed in on the um the, the duplicated drone. But here, how Plankton just says it just doesn't really work. It's funny Bob in the So that's supposed to be the magic conch. Yeah. I wish robots were people too. Oh. What the? <laughs> it's a falling clam, the equivalent of a shooting star. Oh! Oh! No. This way, Patrick! Back. Back. How do you even get there? I don't even know. Oh boy. Oh, right, those robots you never see in the game. Oh. Oh, you again. Hi, lady! Don't, don't do that! Stop, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, goodness. Oh. 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 Okay, you're gonna end it like that? Okay. Um, we, I will say this, we did grow up playing a demo of this game, and uh, the robots here were not animated in that. Oh. Uh, wait, hold on, the robots have red eyes. Oh! I think Purple Lamp was taking some notes. Oh, great. All right, let me set our options here. Uh, let's see. Story tech. Okay, all this is fine. All right, let's go. All right, so here we have uh, one. We have five areas: downtown, the Mermelair, Kelp Forest, the Dutchman's Graveyard, and Chum Bucket Lab. 
all locations from the, you know, the uh, the actual original game from Heavy Iron. Yeah. Um, the only ones we don't have are like Jellyfish Fields, Rock Bottom, the Dream World, which is a really big shame, Sand Mountain, Goolagoon. Doesn't matter. We're gonna go. Um, we're gonna go in this order. So let's go. Plan N. <laughs> Plan N, sort of. No, the chum bucket makes it a little difficult. All right. Graphic jam. Oh, okay. Graphic jam. At least the whole French narrator thing is not uh, messed up here. All right, traffic jam. The Bikini Bottom Magic uh. Shop has just notified us that several magic props from their store have. <laughs> is this right? What? Yes, the magic props have. So what is wrong? Disappeared. Disappeared. It, it, it found. <laughs> Please return. Wow, and I thought I was unprofessional. Oh. <laughs> At once. Uh. <laughs> You're fired. Oh. Robots are everywhere. I have to get to the bottom of this. Where oh, is great. Patrick? He'll help me get these robots under control. Patrick. Patrick. Okay. Use the mouse to move SpongeBob through the streets of Bikini Bottom. Avoid the boat mm. driven by Plankton's evil robots. Collect all of the magic props. Um. And continue to the next game. All right, it's what we do. We have to cross the road. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Kermit, I don't know if it's just me. Look, this is reminding me a little well, bit about a little arcade game from the 80s that starred a frog. Hmm, yeah. I think it's best we should just spill the beans right now. This game, unlike Battle for Bikini Bottom for the console, where that's a 3D open world adventure game, this is just a compilation of arcade remakes with Spongebob slapped on him. Yeah, so this one's Frogger? Yeah, this one's Frogger. Alright. Oh. Oh, wait, but that's... I hope they don't rip off my game. Don't. Yours is a... Oh, forget it. Yours is a licensed game. They, they, they wouldn't rip you off. I mean my arcade game. I get it, I get it, but still... Besides, if they did that directly, then they'd probably get sued. What? I make fun of people all the time. Okay, fine. Point taken. Oh yeah, these objects that we're collecting are important if we want to get to the end of the game. Or not the end of the game, but the uh, the end of the worlds. And also to play the bonus levels that serve no purpose. Alright, one more. Freeze! Actually, oof, oof, oof. Or even if they're frozen, you can still get hurt by them if you run into them like a dumbass. <laughs> okay, what's the stars? I think those are extra points. Extra credit. Alright. Oh, and there's SpongeBob. No. Uh, nice job! You collected a crystal ball! <laughs> It'd be funny if the robots yelled, get out of the road. <laughs> get out of the road! Okay, we did that without dying once. Interesting. All right, we've unlocked the next game. Crazy robot drivers. Our plan is to do one world okay. per part. Oh, if I only had something to refresh my memory, memory, memory. Hmm. Okay. Click a manhole cover to reveal a character. Manhole game. memory. Uncover two matching characters to make the manhole disappear. Clear all three levels to continue to the next game. All right. Okay, what we have here? Uh, hello. Oh, what? That was wrong. Hold on. Okay, wait. Oh, yeah. This is a memory game. The sleepy time. Um. It looks like it. I think it shares an older, uh, striking resemblance. Like um, or like that. The top of his head is different. 
And I think it was supposed to be like that in like early screenshots of Battle for Bikini Bottom. Uh. Wait, we just got 90 points for one of them and then 100 for the other. Yeah, if you can find those, click, the faster you click, the more points you get. That makes no sense. Whatever. SpongeBob. <gasps> Clancy Brown? Uh, I guess so, yeah. Clancy Brown. Uh, is that why they could uh, you know, they just reversed the animations. Uh, Plankton, I saw you somewhere. Nope. Okay. Oh, goody! <laughs> Good thing we got with Mr. Krabs, you would have seen that. Okay, I think this one combines both the robots and the, uh... The, oh, I haven't seen you before! Okay. Oh, no, neither you. It combines the robots and the regular, uh, Patrick. Okay, get rid of you. Squidward. Uh, stop. Patrick. Stop. Okay. Okay, you were up there. Okay, yeah, no. There are different robots here. Oh, the right. There we go. Is that it? Okay, that's it. We've unlocked the next game. Alrighty. Oh, that did the trick. I remember now. I gotta find Patrick and stop these robots. Hmm. Patrick! Do you have to keep doing that? Oh, jeez. Where are we going? Oh. What go get you, 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 you. Oh. I know you are. What am I? <laughs> Patrick. Uh, why is he speaking gibberish? He's in a cage. Oh, 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 poor Pat. Hey, what are you doing in that cage? Patrick, oh, I'm not in a cage. You are. Hey, I may be stupid, but I'm no dummy. You, no, you're Mr. not a dummy. You're a retard. Clearly the one inside <laughs> oh, the no, cage. We shouldn't, we shouldn't joke Trust about that. Trust me, Patrick. Sorry. You are the one in the cage. Don't worry, old pal. Oh. I'll get you out. No way, I'm gonna <laughs> let my best buddy dry out in the slammer. You're the one in the slammer. Patrick, just sit back and watch the master uh, at so, work. So, Patrick's behind bars. How do we get rid of him? Questions correctly. We have, have to answer have trivia. Oh, boy. You better know the show. Long answers will be oh, boy. Score at least 500 All right. points. This should be easy. To the next game. I am an expert on... Spingle Bab. Oh, what Spingle Bab. I can see. Okay, never mind. You don't have to be Einstein about SpongeBob in order to know this. <laughs> We're off to a blistering start. Oh. Uh. 100. Um, the only way to get 100 points on this or a perfect score is to answer the questions within a second. Uh. Get Barnacle Boy because there's no Mermaid Man. Yeah. In order to get 100 points. For a question, you have to answer it within the first second, which is very, very, very crappy. Uh, who is Patrick's best friend? He's only standing there. Find the founder, the health inspector. Oh, uh, uh, you're working at Pizza Castle. I don't know, he did become friends. All right. Who is Patrick's alter ego? Oh. Uh, what? Barnacle Boy, I guess, because he dresses up as Barnacle Boy. Toilet Man! Wait, what? Oh, Toilet Man! Uh-oh. Rock the Pink Menace! Who's the Pink Menace? Well, that, that's not a thing. What? Who did Patrick take to his run? <laughs> his mom. Pearl! Card <laughs> I didn't realize that. Okay. Ah. 
All right. Who lives next door to Patrick? Uh, Squidward. Squidward. That's a trick. That that the throw for a look there, because technically SpongeBob lives two houses away, or like a house after Squidward. So technically, Patrick doesn't live next door. Well, I mean, kind of. I don't know. What does Patrick live under? <sighs> Rock. A billboard. <laughs> a van. Uh. Yeah! Alright. Way to go! You've earned a magic wand! Good. <laughs> what is Patrick's last name? Star. Fancy pants. Diddly bop diddly do. Fish face. Oh, God. Okay. What does Patrick have on the roof of his house? Great antenna. A satellite dish. An old pair of sneakers. None of the above. Oh, Jesus. Alright, we got one more question after this. Last one. Then we can free Patrick. Which is not something Patrick likes to do. Uh, exercise. <laughs> All right. All right. Pat's free. Okay. There you go, little buddy. Now tell Patty. Patrick, Pooh. again, you were behind the cow, whatever. We have to stop the robots from taking over Bikini Bottom. Robots, huh? This sounds like a job for him. Him? Man. No, we're talking SpongeBob. about him from the Powerpuff him. Girls. Oh, is no, that's a bad guy. Oh. Him. Yes, SpongeBob. This is a job for. What? <gasps> what? Uh. Oh, the Oh, uh, that's what the pink man. Well, that's really cheeky Use putting that after the. Oh my god. Or light to avoid robots uh, and crash cans. Robot Click the mouse button to Now I feel. I mean, I can't really blame myself here. All of the How was I supposed to? to however. To the next game. That is some gold X award material execution there. Okay, so there was, was that green sleepy time? It's not really sleepy time, I guess, considering they're not sleeping. Also, I just realized, we're something crap! Oh, oh, that kills us. Okay. I was gonna go over here and get these. Nice green ones. You don't have to kill all of them. It's mainly for points. This is a point game. Okay, so like level four of each world, you get to play as the character you have to rescue. And you have to get, basically get payback on the robots. Yeah. All right. All right. Wonder if I could throw with right click. Oh, I can. Oh. I got hit as soon as I hit him. That's not that that that. What sense does that make? Uh, okay. Okay. Slow. Okay. Oh, it's a tight squeeze. Okay. There is the last object. All right. All right. Let's do it. Patrick's flickering for some reason. What is with that freaking gibberish? Uh, somebody explain that. Why is Patrick speaking gibberish in this game? Isn't nature wonderful? 
Okay. Oh, thank you for recovering my stuff. If you would be so kind, please put everything back where it belongs. I think that's the only well, stock voice in this Mr. game. Rising, uh, Mr. Magic, uh, Mr. Trick Guy, sir. <laughs> Trick Guy, sir. Hmm, let's see here. All right. We turn all of the magic props. The magic, to the magic shop. shop owner. All right, so now this is why we need to collect all those items. We complete this, we get a bonus level. The magic props correctly yeah. to continue to the next game. I don't. I saw. I've never really tried. I'm not even sure if they'll let you do this if you don't have all the items. So, yeah. But if you put it in the wrong place. I don't think that's a good idea. Bad alone. I don't want to do that. I don't think that's a good idea. There was a different sound. I thought it was a different sound that played. Thing goes here. Uh, was there any ones that we found confusing here as a kid? Um, nah, these are pretty self-explanatory, actually. Maybe this one. Why is that person trapped in the thing? I don't want to even know. We've unlocked the final game. Uh, Patrick, what are you oh, doing? this is one from the demo. Oh, oh. remember this one fondly. Yeah. Oh, hi, SpongeBob. I was just preparing myself. This bowling alley looks like, um, oh, whatchamacallit, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the Reef Cinema. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. What about the robots, Patrick? Oh, did you say bowling? Uh, I've always wanted to go bowling. Can you teach me? Well, SpongeBob, the key to bowling is one simple word. One. Be the ball. Be yeah, 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 the yeah, yeah, ball. Ah, yeah, yeah. uh, that's three words. Words of Patrick. wisdom. No, it isn't. Look. The that is three. <laughs> oh, the dang it put batches in there. The ball, uh, huh? Okay, I'll give it a try. All right, be the ball. Click the mouse button. Look at be the ball. Let's be the ball. The Pulling buddies. Make sure the He's literally the ball. Oh, God. That's not the, the ball to go. The more pins you knock down, right. the higher your score will be. Okay, so this one has no relevance to the plot. Um, it's just, uh, a little bonus thing, so, yeah. Oh, it's a bully. Let's go. Alright. Um, I never got it, but apparently I've looked in the game files. Apparently there is a, um, a four-strike thing. Is there a such thing? I mean, I know that two strikes is a double, and uh, three strikes is a turkey. But is there one for four? I don't know. Well, apparently, I remember. I remember in the game files, this game says it is, but I don't think anyone. I don't know if like we're definitely not good enough to get to that. Oh great! Uh, strike! Strike! So go for a double. Okay, nope. Oh. Oh. Oh, dang it! Go. All right. Okay, hold on. I think I've noticed something. It's a double. Can we go for a turkey? Turkey. Go for the turkey. We got a turkey. All right. Now let's see if we can get that one that we're talking about. Nope, we didn't get it. That, that's enough. Oh, dang it. Well, we, we got a turkey. It's more than we could do with any other bowling game. Yeah, good point. You see, there's different animations here. Yeah. Alright. Let's go. Yoink! There's also, I think, animation for getting a split. I'm not sure if we'll be able to show that, though. Alright. Let's see if we can show the split. Nah, nah. We just screwed that over. We won't be able to get the extra shot. Oh, whatever. Oh, no, no, no. Extra shot. Give me a strike. Oh, there's a split. No, no, it was the last one, so they don't show an animation. Oh, that's, that's, that's very poopy, if you ask me. Uh, I'm trying to cut down on stuff. Oh, of course. All right, downtown is completed.
All right. So, this concludes part one of the PC version of Battle for Bikini Bottom. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. If you want to see us play a certain game, be sure to request it in the comments. Uh, don't forget to uh, follow us on Twitter and Twitch. And uh, we'll be seeing you soon for part two.